welcome to Lubero, the Swiss periplan producers and breeders. And of course, we are also producing some ornamental plants. My name is Markus Kobold. I'm breeder and founder of Lubero. And today I'm talking how to prune a Siberian pea shrub, and car well, uh, a Cargana arborescens pendula, a hanging Siberian pea shrub. The first and the good thing is you don't have to do anything in the first year. You have the ground here at the height of about 120 to 140 centimeters, and the, the, the branches are just growing down, down to the ground. Of course, after two, three years, when they are reaching the ground, you can bring them back a little bit that they are, they, they are not reaching the ground. Just do what you want to do. After four, five, six years, you will have the first old branches, which are becoming naked here don't have any leaves anymore, are becoming too thick. And then you ca can prune them back to 5 to 10 centimeters from the crown. Here you have the crown, here we have the grafting point, and here we have the crown. So we are pruning back after four, five, six years, every year, one branch uh, to five, six centimeters. And then from this point, new branches, which are uh, full of leaves and flowers, will develop again. And so the whole head, the whole shrub, the whole ornamental shrub will stay young. Otherwise, it becomes naked here in the center and has leaves only down in the branches. So every year, pruning back one old branch to 5 to 10 centimeters, uh, that is the only thing you have to do in the long term. Of course, with the help of pruning, you can only also uh, uh, say to the plant how they the plant has to develop. If you are doing nothing, the crown will stay like this, small, very good for a pot, very good for a patio or a balcony. But if you want to become it a little bit bigger, prune them back in the first three, four years, every year, prune everything back after the blooming period, after the blooming time. And then here, new shoots will develop. And next year, you are again pruning back. And though the whole crown will become a little bit broader and bigger and the plant will become broader and bigger. So by pruning you can make the plant bigger and not smaller, uh, which sometimes is not understood by some people. So if you prune back, the plant will become bigger. If you don't prune, the plant will stay like this and very compact for a patio or for a pot. If you have some experience in pruning Siberian pea shrubs, hanging Siberian pea shrub, please write your commentaries below, share your experience with other gardeners, and go on gardening.